Hello everyone and welcome back to XM channel. It's Monday, June 15th. I'm Christina Barthenibu, investment analyst, taking a look at the gold market in the daily chart. So zooming in, we can see that gold had an encouraging upside reversal near the upper surface of the Chimoku cloud last week, but uh, this wasn't enough to take us out of the two-month-old uh, neutral zone. Uh, more importantly, the market failed to print a higher high above its previous peak of 1765 for another week, and that uh, continues to keep downside risks alive as the downward direction in the RSI the MACD is currently suggesting. Uh, so, if the price manages to slip below the uh, 20 day moving average, currently around 1718, I expect uh, the upper surface of the cloud near 1680 to come back under the spotlight. In case the decline extends inside the cloud, uh, pushing gold out of the short-term neutral zone, uh, immediate support could come near uh, 1640 before we see a more aggressive sell-off towards uh, 1595 and the 200-day moving average. Uh, now, if the price was to hold above the 20-day uh, MA, I would like to see a break above 1750. Uh, more specifically, a close above the top of uh, 1765, in which case uh, the rally may print a new higher high near 1800. Above that, uh, there is no important resistance in sight until we reach the 2011 record highs between uh, 1880 and 1920. Finally, looking at the uh, medium term picture, uh, the market structure here remains positive, uh, justified by the higher highs and the higher lows, and only a drop below the previous low of 1680 could change that to a neutral one. So that's all from me. Thank you for watching and have a great day.